What's going on, everybody? Eric Burgett here. Hope y'all are having a good week. Thanks for tuning in to my Cook It with Burgett. What are we having? What are we having? Ahoy, mateys! Welcome aboard the Burgett cruise ship. Tonight, we're gonna be beer battering, tater cutting. We're cooking some beer batter fish and chips. Here's what we do, y'all. You get yourself some taters. We got our taters cut. We're sailing this ship right into a bowl of bush light, y'all. What should I do with a drunken tater? What should I do? All right, y'all, you're gonna put your bowl of taters in the fridge for about an hour. We got our taters soaked in our beer. They've been soaking for an hour. What we're gonna do, we're gonna drain the bowl. We didn't waste too much beer. I mean, it soaked it up. The potatoes soaked it up. You are going to pat these dry before we throw them in the oven. You're gonna salt and pepper them. I like a lot of salt and pepper, so I'm gonna crack a lot of salt and pepper on there. If you haven't already, get your oven set to 450. Toss them in some olive oil, and then you're gonna put them in the oven for a half hour, 40 minutes, depending on how golden and crispy you want them. Pardon my French. Fry. Beer soaked fries. They're beer soaked fries. Hey Google, set timer for 30 minutes. Only if you give me fish and chips. Meanwhile, back at the ship, we are cooking our beer battered fish. So first off, you get yourself some cod or any white fish for that matter. Cut up those fillets, some flour, a little bit of salt and pepper, one egg, Y'all, I also want to give a very special shout out to my buddy Jack for the farm fresh eggs. So, uh, thank you, dude. One can of a bush a latte. Stir it on up. Got our beer batter, y'all. Got our beer batter. Get yourself an extra plate of flour. We want to get our fish nice and covered before we uh, put them in the batter. But first, the hidden treasure inside these filet of fish. My hunk of burger love hot chicken rub. You can use whatever seasoning you want. Your choice. But if you do want some of my Hunkaburger Love Hot Chicken Rub, reach out to me, Facebook, Instagram, wherever. Get these nice and coated. And then we are gonna put them in our batter. If you haven't already, get your oil sizzling. Trey, on biscuits and gravy. That brick church is saving with the choir sings, oh, I You want to keep these fishies swimming in that oil till your fillets are nice and crispy, golden brown to your liking. Uh, probably about eight minutes, flipping them halfway through. Smelling like a dive bar up in here, y'all. You can't have fish and chips without a dang good tartar sauce. You get yourself some pickles, some Greek yogurt, some mayo. And some Worcestershire sauce. Stir it on up. How's the fries doing? How's the fries doing? Ooh. We have uncovered half of our treasure tonight. Here's what we're gonna do. Change of plans. We're gonna keep this oil that our fish were frying in. What shall we do with a drunken tater? Dip in the old buoy twice in the oil. Dip in the old buoy twice, they say. All right, y'all, we got ourselves a feast tonight. Beer battered, fish, and chips. Thank y'all for joining in. Have a good night. That's how I was raised.